Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So over the better part of the last year, I have been posting a couple of videos about the new Microsoft Designer app. And if you want more info, just do a search on the channel. But just to do a quick recap, uh, the Designer app um, is part of the Microsoft 365 apps and will help you create social media posts, invitations, digital postcards, and so on. So basically, it's a souped up version of PowerPoint uh, just to give you a kind of a brief overview. Now, um, approximately halfway through uh, the month of October last year, 2022, I joined the waiting list as I actually did post on. And just to let you know that a good couple of months later, I finally am um, been um, moved into the designer program and can now try out the new Microsoft designer with Microsoft saying the wait is over, you're in. So just to let you know that if you haven't checked your inbox and you were waiting for the designer app and you did join the waiting list, go check your inbox as you might have received the same email, you might have received it already or maybe not. But just to give you a brief overview as to the whole process and just do an overview of the actual Microsoft designer app now that I can actually show you the app in real time. So after receiving the email, um, which I did receive 14 hours ago, so that was over the last couple of hours, um, you would obviously have to um, be signed up using your Microsoft account. So at first it will prompt you to sign in, which I've already done. That's the splash screen, which can take a couple of seconds depending on your device uh, to launch and run. Now this is basically the welcome and homepage to um, basically start a new project. Now you can also, if you X out of that, you can actually um, start a new design by clicking on this tab, which will take you to the same page. And yeah, you can see, let's start with your content and um, describe the design you'd like to create. And yeah, they've given us an example. And you can add own images from this device, from your phone, my media. And you can also start with an AI generated image. So um, artificial intelligence has made it uh, into the designer application. So Microsoft very intent on using AR and across all its different products, as many of you would know by now. And so that's basically how you start a project. And then just looking at some other options, this is a blank t a template. And if we head to the left, we get um, our templates we can choose from. And you can search through all of these different options. So there's some templates uh, you can use. My media, so you can upload from uh, this device, your phone, Drive, Dropbox, Google Photos. You can also drag and drop your files or select them from this device by clicking on that tab. Visuals, um, so this gives you um, different visuals. So yeah, we get all, fold shapes, organic shapes, and so on. You can generate those. You can use different photos, graphics, and video. So there are a couple of templates text uh, that will just um, let you use uh, different text formats and different sizes and then your style so there we go you can use a couple of different styles and then as mentioned um, you basically um, you click on this link new design and you can start that project and go through all the different steps and then once you've uh, finished your project uh, you can save that for later and then you'll also be able to download um, that um, project you have created using the Microsoft Designer and this is just the drop down flyout menu with a whole lot of different options. So that's just a brief overview um, of the new Microsoft Designer now officially starting to roll out in my region. So as mentioned you may have seen it already, you may have not and if you haven't checked your inbox go check it as you might have received uh, the email. So thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.